Today we're looking at great games that nobody plays. Our first game, WCW Revenge. WCW Revenge, pretty similar to WWE No Mercy, just, you know, WCW. Now this is probably the best WCW game in the franchise. Well, and this, was also, this was also the one before WCW Backstage Assault, which, um, uh, that's terrible. Evan likes it for some reason. Just so, yeah, WCW, it, the, it, this is truly classified as a great game that nobody plays. Our next one, WCW World Tour. WCW World Tour. This is one of a kind. Like, I don't remember really anything that's similar to this. Yeah, just, okay, just, also, I'm up. Sorry about that. So, I'm, uh, and also, there's this one boxer character that's extremely overpowered. Kind of like Roman Reigns and WWE 2K22, but still. Uh, yeah, I'm, so this is truly a great game that nobody plays. The game's okay, I think. Our next one, our next one. Super Mario 3D World. Now, this is more of an Evan game, but... Evan, tell us about it. So, see, this con this game was made for the Wii U, which was not a really good selling console. But this game, although was a hidden gem in the Wii U. Wise words. Also, everyone loves the Wii U these days, but when it came out, no one liked it. Okay. So, fun fact, it's the least selling Nintendo, it's a, it's the worst selling Nintendo console of all time. Are we talking home consoles? Yes. Okay, good, because then it would bring up the Virtual Boy. Oh, yeah, that too. No, that's a handheld. Yeah, I know. Hmm. Uh, so, yeah, I'm, uh, yeah, but according to Evan, well, according to what Evan said, this is truly a great game that nobody plays. Our next one, WrestleMania 2000. So this game is pretty similar to Dunny No Mercy as well, but, um, uh, well, it was the precursor. This was the precursor to Dunny No Mercy. WWE No Mercy is a bit better in my opinion, but, uh, still, this is a really good game. My only criticism is that Midian's in the game. That's my one criticism. Oh, and the Job Squad ain't in the game. Wait, actually it is. Not my Blue Dust ain't in the game. But still, great game. That Who's no Blue one... Dust? You know who the Blue Media is? Yeah. Just think of him, but as Gold Dust. Okay, uh, yeah, that's that's gonna haunt my nightmares. Okay. Next game. Next game. Marvel Ultimate Alliance. Once again, this is more of an Evan game. Explain. Uh, see, see, this game was a start of a pretty good, uh, of a decent franchise. franchise except it feel like it just slipped on the radar over the past few years. No, I haven't heard anybody talk about it, you know, I, I've, I've seen nothing about it, but honestly, I really like the game. And also what I think sort of uh, took it down is that it's very similar to X-Men Legends. And that game, was, it was a popular game, except this game, I say it's better, except it's truly a game that nobody plays. Thank you. Like Evan said, great game that nobody plays. Our next one, my personal favorite on the list. X-Men Mutant Apocalypse. Now, X-Men Mutant Apocalypse, if you saw a recent video, I'm, uh, well, you saw that, I'm, uh, you, you are able to get past the first couple of levels with a password, which I think is really cool. Also, about that, I did say what Evan said, that, uh, we will put the password in the comments. Well, the comments are disabled. Thank you, YouTube. But, uh, well, if they're not disabled in this one, we'll put it in the comments of this one. But, uh, yeah, but, uh, so, um, uh, this is also more of an Evan game, uh, uh, okay, I love, I love all these games, except, like, half of them, but Evan plays more. Evan, explain. So, see, this game is very, is a really good side scrolling beat em up for the Super Nintendo. Wait, excuse me. <sighs> Sorry. You okay? Yeah, I'm fine. Allergies. Okay, so, and then, yeah, this game also had a Game Boy Color port, but, let's like, be fair, no one knows good. Yes, this game is. We own that, right? No, we don't. We own Mutant Academy. Oh, okay. Well, that game's great. Hey, oh, brother, brother. We're doing the same video, but with handhelds coming soon. Alright, so now this game is truly a great game that nobody plays anymore. Thank you. 
Our next game, pretty sure some people might play this, but I haven't heard anyone talk about it. Lego Batman 2 DC Superheroes. One of my favorite Lego games. Now, a fun fact, I actually own every uh, Lego game since some, uh, uh, that one for the Game Boy Color. It was for the Game Boy Color, right? Yes, uh, Alpha Team, I believe. Yeah, that one. And so I'm, um, uh, wait, okay, so, okay, so, uh, Lego game wise, I own, uh, we own Alpha, Alpha Team, and, uh, everyone, and everyone up from, uh, Lego Marvel, Lego Marvel Super Heroes to, um, uh, wait, no, actually, the Lego Batman video game. Okay, so this is a game that nobody plays because it's, it's just probably a, m a more forgettable one, but still, great. It's a great game that nobody plays. Oh, just, I, I, I own Alpha, we own Alpha Team and every Lego game came uh, from, uh, the original Lego Batman to, um, uh, Skywalker Saga. Thank you, Ethan. Great game that nobody plays. Great. Also, why did they have to make Supergirl so hard to get to? Okay, uh, our third to last one, Raw 2. Raw 2. A great comeback from the uh, original Raw, which I have for the PC, actually. And I haven't played it since, I don't know. Like I haven't 20, played it for years. Like 2019, 2018? Yes, like 2019. It's that bad, trust me. And I really got, like... I got less than 10 wins on that thing, I think it's actually- You've cool. gotten zero wins! No, I've, I've got a win before. Okay, back to the game. Please. Yeah, yeah, I won as a- We don't care, I Ethan! I Raven as Taz. Now, okay, now back to the- now back to Raw 2. It's just a forgettable game. It, it, it is kind of forgettable, but I still really like it. There's actually a season mode! Close up, close up, right here! Okay, great. Yeah, this is truly a game that nobody plays. Great game. Yeah, nobody great plays. game. Also, way more match types, way better roster. Just great game that nobody plays. Second to last one, The Simpsons Game. Now, Simpsons Game, it's The Simpsons. What you gonna say? Now, it is a, a bit It is a bit worse than Simpsons Hit and Run, except that is a, fanta that is a fantastic That is a fantastic game. I, I own okay, I really need to get back on topic, but just, so just uh I own Hit and Run from the PC and uh GameCube. And so I'm uh yeah I'm uh so this game I am stuck on a level. Just can't figure just can't remember which one it has been a while since I played this. But still, great game that nobody plays. Final one Roadrunner and Wally Coyote. Now, Roadrunner and Wally Coyote, what, it's my favorite cartoon. It's my favorite cartoon. Yes, uh, so I'm, uh, yeah, I'm just, uh, like, it is, it is a fantastic, it is a fantastic game. Like I said, it, it is surprisingly fun. Same with the Rocky and Bullwinkle game, but we haven't really played that one much yet, so we couldn't put it on the list. Oh, I played it, it's really good. We'll make that 11 games then, we'll make that 11 games then. <laughs> So yeah, this, this is a, uh, yeah, it's a fantastic game, a Roadrunner Wally Coyote, what you gonna say? Great, great cartoon, you make a great game out of it, and uh, yes, and uh, also, it, it's very, like the Roadrunner mechanics, very similar to Sonic the Hedgehog, I also think this was made to compete with Sonic now that I think about it, but yeah, great game that nobody plays, and that's all we have for the time, that's all 10 games, T-E-E-M, large out.